He's whipping out the Amy. Yep. This He's is gonna a pretty good option game. here because, uh, like, um, you're gonna want, like, you're gonna see Voto go for those 50-50s, and uh, if Amy manages to get guess right on them, we're gonna see a lot of easy roses. We're gonna see a lot of easy lethal hits once he gets a uh, max white rose. And of course, uh, Amy's got a lot of nice evasive little low pokes. Her 2A, her 4A are both really nice to uh, deal with a character that's running towards you to try and force a mix up. But it's so, good block so far. Gets the 3A. Yes, 3A is another one, of course. Really good at shutting down pressure. Uh, just the pressure ex exuded by Yutoto right now. Doesn't seem like Kamizono can get anything started. Oh, very nice duck under the high for another white rose. From the mid range, he's got two of those right now. And one red now oh, and measure. one measure. He's gonna try and aim for another one. Does oh. try to get it. No regi there from Yutoto means he actually manages to secure this round. Battle two. Fight. Go, and nothing. Nice to see that we're actually on this stage with uh, two characters that can't really use it that much. So I want to see if uh, both characters actually do some adaptation. Because normally you don't associate these two characters with Ring Up. Yeah. Oh, big whiff there from Kamizono, rightfully punished by Yutoto. Yutoto just backing oh. away all oh, that double whiff. Kamizono definitely, you know, trying to find his way in here, but it seems like Yutoto is taking advantage of it right now. And uh, Kamizono is definitely playing Yutoto's game. Fallen to the pressure. Gonna have to soul charge there. Oh, just get the, uh, just get the Tuchin's A. Just gonna see if, uh, yes, oh. he does manage to get correctly on the mid. And now he's in white, so actually if he manages to get one good auto GI or reversal edge, this is going to be over. Oh, oh. unfortunately Vodo can break back throws. It was a good idea, but nonetheless. Just a sidestep to finish it off real quick. Round two. It's the second time in a row that like Kamizono's gone for the AMS B option, the spinning. Uh, okay, third time round, oh, and all three funny. times, Yutoto has made him pay for it. So I want to see what adjustment he actually makes with, with regards to that stance. Successfully gets another red rose off his FC3K combo. Trying to pressure him towards the edge. Yep, Maybe Kamizono's got something up his sleeve here, but it, if he's not careful, looks like it's gonna backfire. He's gonna have to soul charge to get out of there. Oh, went for the GI there, but punished by Yutoto. Oh. Also, just the pressure from having your back towards the cliff like that definitely make you want to block high or get ready for a grab. I like how Yutoto, in spite of the soul charge, just backs away, stays perfectly calm. Waits for Amy to run in, then just does throws out a small poke, stops her from doing a mix-up, and closes out the round just like that. I wonder if we're gonna get a switch here from Kamizono. I know it, it did go back to the stage selection. Oh no, they went back to the character selection. Oh, he's thinking about it. I mean, nope. like if you're someone Locked like in. Kamizono and like you pick Amy and you get that stage, you're kind of like, Ugh. yeah, you know, I could have had a good time. Oh, right there, especially that yeah. stage, yep. the best stage in Soul Calibur. The best stage for Sokumina. But Noah, that's not going to get something, he's going to get something pretty good as well. Alright, so... Like, this one's, yeah, this one's a little bit, this stage is a little bit wide, but they do start relatively near uh, the edge of the screen, so... And off the bat, you can see Yutoto stepping away from the ring edge. And looks like Kamizono's not afraid to put his back to the stage there. Nice Man, is this oh, that launch though. He's went for the ring out. It's just but almost oh. all of these exchanges. Yutoto is just winning them. He's making all the right choices, pushing all the right buttons at the right times. Seems like Kamizono definitely trying to get in there, but just dropping his shield just a little bit too early. And there his guard. Is the whiff punish into the into the kill for the first round. I really, I'm gonna, I wanna wonder because against Flash God earlier, Kamizono had a real issue with uh, blocking lows. Mm -hmm. So I'm wondering whether Yototo is gonna make that adjustment. He does have some deadly lows and blind stuns, you know, the 2A plus B, the knockdown with a ton of damage. But no, so far he's choosing to play a bit more of a spacing game. There you go. Pick him up for the damage. For the Oki and the wow, guard damage. Raw 3B catching Kamizono. If you're okay. gonna be able to apply that much guard damage. I really like uh, Yutoto jumping in between of his uh, Mantis treasure game because then if you try and launch him or punish him out of it, he's actually going to be airborne and as you can see at the end of that round, he actually made a combo with. But now Kamizono is going to use the meter to secure with... Oh, doesn't oh. actually go for the ringer combo! 
Maybe Choosing? he wanted the guard damage yeah, there. I think he was investing. Oh, but is that going to win? Is that going to be it? It is. But unfortunately, Yutoto manages to close it out. I think you're really right. Like, he was investing in the future round. That was clearly a ring out combo waiting to happen. Yeah, that maybe it's just a little bit too high of a risk there. But maybe he thought he could seal it out. It was Ooh, a gamble he was very, willing to take. Very nice 4 4 eight, eight hit there. But I think Yototo was not prepared because he actually missed his follow-up before that. But now, ooh, another big whiff. And now the investment is actually trying to show some, uh, gonna show some fruit. Let's see if he can... You know, oh, okay. He's so, actually able to bring it forward two games. Yeah, exactly. Two rounds. Is it going to pay off this round? So it goes... It's always, it's always like the best case scenario to use it to pressure your opponent enough to close the match without actually breaking the guard, so you can keep carrying it forward over and over again. All right, good choice there. Barely tapping him. The edge of that's going to be a lethal hit. Oh, and that right is probably the, the break. worst oh. way to guard crush an opponent. So mean, uh, the frustration shows on Kamizono's face. Spent all that time and oh the investment. Unfortunately, doesn't pay off. What is Kamizono going to do here? Stick it to the 1B. Oh, wow! Gets just 2 ing in between the 1B sequence to interrupt him. Very gutsy and nice play from Yutoto. Oh. He finally closes it out with a simple 3K. Yutoto, 2 nil so far against Kamizono. Oh, that was a shame. The young oh, master. Definitely lost that one round to an investment that didn't even pay off. I mean, this is how it goes sometimes, right? Can't put all your eggs in one basket. All right, let's see how true Kamizono would change enough. it up. Gonna even it out. Oh, gets the knockdown off of this uh, auto GI. Very nice Oki. reset. Just chooses to go for more guard damage. He's really investing. He's working in a perfect here. So what better thing to do than to go for guard damage? Oh, the whiff punish just stuck too far away. Gets the just frame, but it doesn't come out in time. Now Kamizono just needs that one last hit. Is he is he gonna invest in more guard did damage though? I mean, he better hurry up and finish his round out yep. fast, and he does take the, the first round. I get a feeling he was trying to go for it, but then he started realizing that Yutoto was coming back. It was like, nah, just, I'm just going to 2AU. Like, you're done. I mean, he had that time, but fortunately ran out. We got here, man. Just Yutoto breaks in a row. Not able to throw Yutoto at all. He's on point with this, man. He better go to a casino. His odds are looking pretty good. So a nice adjustment from Kamizono. He actually stopped trying for it after getting it broken twice. But unfortunately, now this uh, back and forth uh, little waltz that they are playing is not favoring Kamizono as much. More good gut damage. He's getting a bit more oh. of a lively thanks to all the small pokes here and there. But it's also a situation where nice. oh, yeah, one hit from either player is going to take it. Gets the lethal hit off of that. Kamizono Kami back alive. Definitely waiting for it. Opportunities going for the pokes here. Kamizono. Oh, wow, but, but Yutoto. And tried to go for the ring up combo as well. And very nice. He didn't get the ring up combo, but he went straight for the pressure again. And this is going to ring him out. Oh. Very wow, nicely that's played clean. by Voldo, by, by, by Yutoto. Yeah. Ooh, he's going to get the raw launch off of that. And just get a good follow up. Push Yutoto all the way to the ring edge. And now he's going to aim for 4-4-A. Good block from Yutoto. The nice whip, punish. no punish though. Watch actually, the leg. Toto is really concentrating on getting like the positioning he wants, so he actually missed the whip punish there. But now he's gonna get the launcher off of Songmin off of Kamizono's own reversal edge into the mix up. Gets the launcher. What's the wake up here? Kamizono just so charges out of it. I don't want to have anything to do with that pressure. And the second 1B oh, catches him trying to roll. Yeah, you don't want to roll that way. That 1B will definitely catch you. All right, Kamizono on the board with one point. The yep. momentum has started to shift into his favor. Can't blame Yutoto for rolling back, though, because if you went yeah. for the 6-6-A, that would have caught the side tag as well. So good play from Kamizono there. Nice with punish from Yutoto to start us off. Okay, got a bit of the blind stance pressure. Kamizono tried to enter with a 2-A, but unfortunately Yutoto ahead of him. And now launches him on the approach. This oh, compact the plays, that was clean. Six, it was sick as hell. Quick reactions on that. Man, just a compact yet aggressive play from Yuto, though. So, He's okay. going to go for it again. We've seen a lot of the no mix-up mix-ups in this top four. It seems that uh, Kamizono has kind of proved that, you know, that's not something worth going for against him. 
So Yukoto stopping it and just going for traditional 50-50. Pushing Kamizono closer to the ring edge. He's got to be careful here. Kamizono can still ring him out from here. Kamizono, just a series of horizontals there, trying to make sure that Yutoto doesn't step. Allow him to get enough. the launcher. Oh, oh, the duck under How the maximum punish. Man, that man is ready. And that Yutoto is so fast. It's now on match point here against Kamizono. Man, you cannot grab this man, Kamizono. I'm convinced. I'm convinced. <laughs> Oh. So, <coughs> the aggression. He's just gonna have to spend the bar. He's got no choice. Pushing Yutoto towards the ringish though. Gonna go for it again. Whoop. Lots of pressure here. Oh, nice break there off the 1A. That could have rough him out. And now Yutoto responds with the Sochak. Oh, with the unfortunate Kamizono didn't catch it in time. And now this no, is gonna end it for Kamizono. That's gonna end it. The lunging, the, the jumping landfish. Mm. That's one of the most volatile things you could do to someone to end a match. It's just, this character is so wild, man. He's just, just a trickster. Just through the air. And like yeah. Swim through the air. It just seems like out of everything, he has like, you know, a, 